From the, from the general Orange River region, Northern Cape of South Africa, we have a hematoid ferruginous hematite included quartz. This guy has been sawn to stand flat, so standing flat, where, let me just take you around like this. Very, very interesting uh, 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 version or variety this one is. Doesn't have phantoms per se of the hematite, but the the concentration of the hematite is inside the the outer edges of the crystal. Multi generational growth. So the initial growth formation would have been at the bottom, and then a secondary cap of uh, uh, quartz would have come over that. But first, the the uh, original generation would have been coated by some specular hematite crystals, which oxidized, giving it the red coloration. And then, of course, uh, secondary generation of quartz. You'll see there the, the multiple generations. Now, let's have a look for phantoms in these guys. Just see if I can look in. There's, there's color, uh, definite color, but not, not clear phantoms in this particular kind. Also quite interesting, some secondary lines across the sides of the crystal. So from a display point of view, lovely little guy, must be about, I think on this measurement, maybe two inches edge to edge. All the way from the general Orange River region, Northern Cape of South Africa. My preferred point of display on this guy would be uh, this angle. I'd actually focus at an angle like this. So I'd, I wouldn't use the where it's been sawn. I'd go slightly abstract to that.